All right, everybody, we're here in Round Rock in Texas. We're at the Rogue Invitational and getting ready to take on the competition starting tomorrow. We just finished the check-in process and, uh, you know, now it's just nothing but wait until we get started. So follow along this weekend. We're going to have lots of content around what, uh, what happens at this competition and uh, hopefully it's all good. Follow along. Chalk's, actually, check this out. Chalk's like magnetic. Oh, sweet. Fancy. Is there like a good way to get it out though? I don't think so. <laughs> oh yeah, there is. is there There's hole? these holes in the side. I wasn't meant to take the oh. lid off. I see. This is what they call the struggle snuggle. Uh, <laughs> is it good? Yeah, man, it's good. You should go up your mustache. Good luck for you. Yeah, my wife doesn't think so, though. You look like, like some like kind of magician. <laughs> <laughs> Just the, like, the goatee mustache. I've never heard someone call me a magician. I got, I got the front end covered, and then... Once I retire, I'm just gonna do nothing. Once you retire. Yeah, at 60. Saying, when are you gonna retire? When are you gonna retire? And he's just gonna give me the same old answer until you start beating me. You're close this year. 0 oh, and 3 against Pat, but I'm looking to change it. One year, people are gonna stop asking and then I'll retire. When we, start, when we stop giving you the attention. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who's older, you or Travis? Me. But Travis has four kids, so I think that gives him like an extra few years. You know? <laughs> Get out, Before you mess around and take a 40 at the game. <laughs> Hey, hasn't happened yet. Yeah, you, you, I know, but you keep waiting until you're 35 to get out, and you will. Yeah. I agree. I'm, I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna be doing that. <laughs> you need a good solid like one, and then you dip, bro. Oh man, it's good living. It's a good job. You want my job? What? You want my job? I know. That's why I'm telling you to go. <laughs> And they put the feet to the PVC and they're like, so we're going to set the floor, we're going to use this, it's really neat, you do this. And we're all like, why does that, so we all have to do the same way? They're like, yeah, we're like, why? Well, because it's just like the standard. We're like, well, so how come everybody doesn't have to ride the bike at the same height <laughs> for the bike workout? And they're like, well, that wouldn't make any sense. We're like, yeah, wouldn't, would it? We're not the same size, are we? And they're just yeah. like, they, they, it was just what it was. And it was like, all the tall guys, it was like me, Rasmus, Travis, just got railroaded. That was brutal. So hopefully it's not like that. Who's going to win this bike workout? You were rolling. Me. I think I got, does he have small hands? I feel like it's a group workout. You should go ask him when you see him. Well, if you have I'll ask him. Hey, yeah. here you have small hands. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. I feel like he's probably got huge hands and he's gonna, you're going to catch one on the side of the head. <laughs> Some GHD bar muscle up and then...
we just go back from our first briefing um, to brief us for Thursday's surprise event. And surprise, they didn't tell us anything. Um, we showed up and all we got told was we were going to be getting on a bus at 6.40 in the morning tomorrow and then they're taking us somewhere. Um, it sounds like we're going to get more information once we either get on the bus or once we're on that's on site at this off-site area. And it's anywhere from an hour to two hours away. So that's about all the information we got. They said, pack some change of clothes, some runners, and some food. And that's it. So we got an off-site event. We don't know what it is. Uh, probably it'll have some running in it. Probably it'll have a ruck involved with it. But all we know is we're going somewhere else to do it. So I don't know. It felt like a little bit of a could have been an email moment. Uh, brought us all to the venue to tell us that we just had to get on a bus in the morning. But... It's all good, you know, unknown and unknowable and all that stuff. So that's it. Get a good night's sleep tonight. Get some hydration in and uh, do some stretching this evening and try to get all the partying out of my system and then we'll be business for the rest of the weekend. So that's it. All we know for now is that we got to exercise tomorrow. Go figure.